video we are going to cover the topic where steam is not able to sync your files like all the software steam also bumps into network errors uh, today we are going to talk about the error when a steam game refuses to launch properly and an error comes forward saying steam was unable to sync your files for um, whatever the game so this error can be traced back to a number of problems first of all it may be that the steam servers are down and not accessible this happens rarely but it is possible other than that it can be something wrongly configured in your pc some third party program or in interfering with the connection now let's cover this video and see what options we have to fix this issue as a first solution we need to check about steam servers if they are up and running or if they are down there are a lot of ways through which you can track Steam server status on the Steam site, which is purely dedicated to providing this information. You can check the status of different servers, that is United States, Europe, Netherlands, China, etc. If the servers are healthy and up and running, the text would appear as green. If they are offline or going through a lot of loads, they, might, they may appear as red. Some servers may also appear orange or indicate their load is moderate and in what load would overload to server overload the server to its maximum capacity. Not only this, you can also check if the Steam store is working properly as well as the Steam community. If you're experiencing the error where Steam isn't able to sync your game file, you should first check if the Steam servers are down. So here is the link which we can share with you and from here you can check the status you can allow this website to push notify you in uh, desktop notifications so as you can see the text is normal it is green online and it is working fine if you find your server um, as red orange or uh, in a down status you might not be able to sync your file so our next solution is to delete the client registry dot b log file it is used by steam which holds your registration data of the installed games if we delete it the file will be restored on the next login and you preserve all your default settings on each game installed on your computer so this fixes about 30 percent of the problems as this file can get corrupt easily do note that after this solution when you launch steam game again it will prompt you to log to provide your credentials again for the steam so take note of your credentials and then go ahead in performing the solution so we are going to open file browser and uh, before going to the file explorer exit out your steam completely so that it's not running anymore go to c program files steam exit the program files x86 steam now locate client registry dot b log file let's press cl um, let's press again okay so here is the client registry dot b log file you can either rename it to something like client registry old or you can insert some underscores here or anything or you might uh, choose to uh, add some alphabets at the end of the extension so we can also delete this file so let's delete the file and relaunch steam so relaunching the steam will ask us to provide credentials let's pause the video so once you have provided your credentials team will launch and check if the issue is resolved if it still having problem then go back to your steam installation directory um, and uh, steam here you can find steam error reporter dot exe file double click on it to execute the file once done relaunch steam and see if the issue is resolved if this issue is still not fixed, our next step is to delete the user data. 
let's go to steam directory again uh, C program files x86 as on this computer steam and find the folder saying user data here it is so we can also choose to rename it or we can cut it from here and then we can keep a backup for this user data so let's paste it here once it is done stop all steam services from task manager let's see if it is running go to details and let's see if we have anything for steam in processes if we have anything for steam there's none now go back and relaunch your steam client and see if now it is able to sync your files it might require you to re-enter your username and password so don't forget to take a note of your credentials before you perform this step our fourth step is to verify the integrity of game files and repaint the library. We have an article for dedicated to uh, both of these actions. You can go to our website or use the links from description to perform these steps. So let's open the article where it says how to verify the integrity of game files in Steam. You can get this link from the description of this video. You can follow these steps to verify the integrity of your Steam files. And you can also consult this article to so if the in, uh, verification of integrity of steam game files and library uh, didn't help you our next step is to run steam in safe mode with networking so if you are using Windows 7 uh, press F8 while your computer starts if you are uh, using Windows 8 or later you can uh, press shift key cl right click on your start menu and then choose restart let the computer restart to startup options click on troubleshoot click on advanced options click on startup settings and then click on restart once you land on the screen select F5 to enable safe mode with networking so once your computer starts in uh, safe mode with networking launch steam and see if that helps so let me start this computer again so if uh, it still doesn't help uh, the next step is to um, disable your firewall or adding an exception in your antivirus so let's you can follow these steps uh, from our articles the links are given in the description of this video here's the article which will guide you through how you can disable windows firewall uh, for this article and see if that helps and the related step uh, in this step is to also add an exception for your steam in the antivirus or firewall software this link is also given in the video description follow this link and see if you can add an exception in your antivirus our another solution is to disable p2p programs if you are using BitTorrent, uTorrent or any software like that uninstall them and then run a malware check and repair your registry files if you have to then start steam again and 
using administrative privileges and check if your game is still refuses to sync. If your computer is acting weird and there are different advertisements popping up again and again on your home screen, it means that your PC is infected. Try installing a trustworthy antivirus and run a thorough check. If there is nothing left except to reinstall Steam and see if that does the trick. When you re refresh your Steam files, we will preserve your downloaded games so you won't have to download them again. Furthermore, your user data will also be preserved. Like we took backup of your user data uh, in the start of this video, uh, the link is given in, this in the description of this video and here is the article on how you can repair your Steam files. This article will guide you through how you can repair your Steam and how you can uh, fix the issue uh, for reinstalling the Steam and preserve the user data. I hope this video will be helpful for you. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe our channel.